you see people that don't have don't have something they're passionate mm-hmm. about like yeah i like watching this i like doing this but it's not something you're that you can be passionate about and you get to also express yourself with it you know it, it'll eat you up yeah mm-hmm. and i think that more people need to like you know <laughs> Go try something that kind of challenges you and that also you get to express yourself with because, you know, that's, I mean, some people end up ending their life, you know, and it's mm-hmm. like, yeah. Horribly sad. And just uh, shining a light, shining a light on people that are interested in art and music, it tends to be a little bit extra hard for those kids and those uh, people just because, um, well, we tend to have a certain mentality mm-hmm. and a, a sense of, a world, a different worldview on like certain things, mm-hmm. and so I feel like where was I going with this? Point is that uh, musicians are musicians are musicians. They're and sad. They, they're sad. <laughs> they're sad girls and boys. <laughs> hey, yeah, but I'm, I'm all kinds of things. I'm sure with. I mean, I don't know if uh, I'll we'll ask you. You know, like speak for myself. <laughs> yeah, I speak for myself. I, I want to make sure I say that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> we have a disclaimer. Yeah. Um, but I'm sure there's been like based on like what you what you said like people it resonates with people when when you're you know like you listen to something that it, it sounds like when you're sad you listen to something and it sounds sad but it also kind of cheers you up have you had people reach out to you so like, man this made my day like this cheered me up listening to this yes well i get a lot of people saying like uh oh like i feel like i'm in the stars like <laughs> You know, and I'm like, well, that's great. My music, it tends to be melancholic and also like not entirely sad. Um, but yeah, melancholic is the word because yeah. it's like in between sad and happy. Mm-hmm. Um, just feeling a sense of a hope or like... Spacey. 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 Yeah. Spacey. Spacey. I like that. <laughs> yeah. What out of all the... <laughs> Imagine NASA saying that word. <laughs> yeah. You guys spacey. ready to feel spacey to the astronauts? Is it? <laughs> We're going to go do some space stuff today. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Out of all the songs that you have released right now, <laughs> what what was one of the hardest to write? Hardest to write? Well, the, I'll, I'll say this. The hardest to release was Una Noche Más because it's soft and it's very, like, it's very emotional. Mm-hmm. But the, the hardest to sing is Interstellar because it's so... It's high up there. Okay. <laughs> Get yeah, it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A lot of space in between the verses. <laughs> Thanks for laughing, guys. I don't feel that. You're not, it, took me, it took me a second to like realize what you were saying. I was like, huh? I like looked at you. You ever hard. done stand up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I don't get it. You ever done stand up comedy? <laughs> no. <laughs> It doesn't work apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I um, need some more work. That'll kill in the Berkeley oh, physics department. Yeah. Let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I like how oh. she. I like how she said it's very high up there. <laughs> Please laugh. <laughs> she has a I'll say it again. <laughs> applause. <laughs> high up there, like. <laughs> no, you ever see when like uh, you see like all the the Latin festivals and they go applause over yeah. and they're like they tell you to applaud. I oh hate that God. shit so much. <laughs> hate it so don't, much. Don't Francisco when they, oh when they finish God. the song, they're like, yes. okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, bro. I, I, I was like, let us decide if we want to. When clap I was for younger, you. you were trash. Voice. When I was younger, I, I hoped that one day I could be on Don Francisco, <laughs> and my, you know, just never gonna well, happen you, now. You hope, well, because he's he's old. The end of the show too. <laughs> Yeah, I saw a clip of Bud Bunny trying to sing a song to Don Francisco. Really? He's like, ma, 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 ma. and Don Francisco was like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is trash, dude. He's, he's a very traditional man <laughs> who grew up bringing a lot of like classic artists. So yeah. it's a contrast to see like Bud Bunny right in front of him. Like, what are you singing? <laughs> yeah. What, uh, are you a fan of the newer style music? That's also what I was going to ask you. What artists do you like right now that's out? Like, are you into Bad Bunny, J Balvin, like those kind of things? Or are you not? Those are like the party people. But I, I was, I was telling, um, JD that I was listening to Caliucci's on the way over here. Mm. Uh, that's my take on, on that answer. Like, I think I like, I like female artists for mm-hmm. some reason. Who are some of your favorite female artists today? Um, Kali Uchis is one. I like um, Carla Morrison, which I often get compared to. 
but what I like about her is the way she started is somewhat how I find myself right now. Okay. And I think I have a lot of respect for that. Um, and, but I don't listen to her that much lately. I would say Kali, which is one of like my, my right Top now. Right now. Yeah. And, um, this question always fucks with me because I feel like what, it's like they put me on a spot and I can never think of like an artist because <laughs> I listen to like a lot or sometimes right. I don't listen to anything. Right. Right. Yeah. What do you recommend to people listen to? That's what I always like. That could be the same answer. It could be the same answer, but it could bring up. Listen to Gabby Bravo. She's <laughs> like, yeah. super there we go. There we go. <laughs> Love it. Please. <laughs> You're like, please. <laughs> please follow me I'm on trying Instagram. Trying to pay rent. Please, please listen to Gabby Bravo. <laughs> My rent is due on the fifteenth. <laughs> <laughs> Best Street comedian out of Watsonville. Be <laughs> and I need gas money to get back to Watsonville. So. <laughs> we need to up our game and shit. We need to do comedy butt naked. Right. <laughs> I remember this too. <laughs> She's you both take you. He started saying his goodbyes. <laughs> <laughs> At the end, the, I just him. remember the guy coming up and giving me the check, and he goes, "Yeah, that'll be our last time." <laughs> when the Beatles, you know, wrote <laughs> the White Album, did they have to like pass it in front of some drunk? That I, 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 so why, why are we doing?